Hello YouTube, this is Chesco from Stem APK, so welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to continue where we left off. You see, if you recall, in the last tutorial we downloaded the images and we cropped the images, and now we, we created, uh, if you remember, we created the crop YAL and we created the individual folders. Now, we, what I did, and you can do, is you guys, you have to Go inside that PyFaces uh, uh, download that we got from from this download, if you recall, and you gotta go into this after you unzip it and you go inside the zip. You need to go inside, and you're going to bring all the crop images that we created, and you're going to go into each one, and you're going to get three images. Okay, any images that you want. In this case, in my case, I took center light and wink, okay, and I went inside and I created this folder right here, gallery, and I put center light and wink, and then I did center light and wink for each of the subjects, okay? So I did it for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine subjects, okay? So I did center light wink, center light wink, center light wink for all nine subjects, and I created a directory called gallery. And then you have to do the same thing for probes. You gotta go into into the crop yell and take two other images that you didn't use before. For example, you already used center light and wink, so you can use any of the other ones. Okay? In my case. What I did was, I used glasses, normal, and sleepy for each one of the same subjects that I use. You have to use the same same faces, okay? So I use glasses, normal, and sleepy, glasses, normal, and sleepy, glasses, normal, and sleepy, glasses, normal, and sleepy, okay? For all of them, for all nine, it has to be the same and then you put them into the probes directory. So you're going to have these two directories, okay? One of them with two of each, and then the other one with three of each. Three different expressions and two different expressions, okay? Once you're done with all that, now we're ready to run the code. In order to run the code, you need to go inside this directory right here, and this has got the init uh, to initialize, okay? And if you if you are not sure what to do, he has something that is a usage usage text that he tells you how to run the how to run, okay? So he's gonna you're gonna do Python face decimal let let the the, the program know where the image that you're going to probe is and you're going to probe it against the gallery. So you're going to take those three images, probe them, uh, one image out of those three images, and probe them against those two galleries. And you're going to use a threshold of three, and you're going to use six, eig uh, six eigenfaces. Okay? So let's do it. So we're going to do, let me clean up all of these. Uh, Let's clear and clean this. Clear. And let's do, actually, let's just do this. Let's do Python face decimal, pi face decimal, and then the image. I'm going to change it, but I just wanted to be lazy and just copy it. Copy and paste. Okay. So we do, instead of three, the threshold, well, threshold, I'll leave it the same. But instead of six, I'm going to use 15 eigenfaces. And is we're not in Windows, so we gotta do. I think it's up. Uh, where is it? Let me minimize this and minimize this so I know what I'm doing. Okay, so I'm going to go into. Uh, I'm gonna go one up into pi face decimal and then one more 
pie faces. Um, pie gallery, where's the gallery? Okay, so let's do one by faces. No one more by faces. Let's just do it the easy way. Uh, I don't like to do them all of them, but. I don't want to take longer than I'm already have taken, so let's do it the the long way. And gallery, and let's do this image. Let's do let's do center light. This guy right here. Properties. Copy. So that's the image that we're going to be using. And the other image. No, what am I doing? Actually, no, it's the gallery. We're going to go against the gallery and we're going to use probes. And being that we're using him, we have to use this three, one of these three. So let's do sleepy. It's a tough one. Let's do sleepy. Properties and copy. Before I run it, I will will go over it so you know what I'm doing. And then probes and then the name of the image is sleepy. Copy sleepy paste okay okay let's go over it let's close this so you know what I'm doing oh don't tell me that I lost it no I didn't okay so this is what I'm doing I'm I'm taking Python pi faces demo is the faces demo is the the command okay and it's taking the image this image right here it's taking that image right here and he's comparing it it's facing it against the gallery the whole gallery all the images in the gallery and he's creating he's using 15 eigenfaces with a threshold of three okay so basically what you need to know sorry for the, the for the whole long command but uh, that's the image, okay? And the guy against the gallery. Okay, so that's all you need to know. That image found in the props directory that we created and it's going against the gallery using 15 eigenfaces and a threshold of three. So let's just hit enter and can open files by base this small because I'm not in it. And that's why. Uh, pie face that small ls now you gotta be in the right directory in order for this to work sorry guys and try again and can open file fight this one no such file ls cd pie faces ls cd ls cd ls is here. This is where you're supposed to be. Okay. So let's try again. Third time should work. And as you can see, it he used 15 eigenfaces. There was no catch because it was all no. He's trying reconstruction. He created a directory called recon faces with all the reconstructed faces, and then. Is, is telling me that it found uh, 
with a distance of 0 0.49 let's let's check to see if it's true or not so we were subject 4 and it found subject 4 so I think it did get it so but let's check so the, these are the two directories that were created as you can see it created this directory right here and it created this directory right here and if we go inside the directory these are the eigenfaces okay this is the eigenfaces this is uh this is what they were talking about here if you remember these are these eigenfaces right here and it tells you in here if you want to know the is the covariance matrix is is using a couple of the, the this Euclidean distance is this Euclidean distance right here is this distance right here that's what they're talking about okay and uh, you take a look at the page it took 1.21 seconds that's what I was telling you once you run them again once they it has the 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 average image these are the eigenfaces these are the reconstructed faces and as you can see did a very good job when you the more eigenfaces that you use the better job it does reconstructing the faces from uh, from the eigenfaces okay so you can see that's why I went from 6 to 15 so this is an awesome job there huh? as you can see okay these are the reconstructions and I created of course let me this is the average face that I use for all of the uh, images this one has information of, on all the images once you have that it is is almost real time you can throw huge databases at it and it will they will work really fast but this is how it works and I will go in, and and show other this was PCA eigenfaces then we'll go with other other recognition algorithms I just wanted uh, to show this one first this is the end of the tutorial if you like this tutorial please click the like box and subscribe to my channel and we'll see you next time thanks for watching